All right, we're going to try and move this big berth of far log on the right. But the challenge is we're not going to move all this garbage here. So I'm going to try and pull in forward and try and strap that so I can barely get that back end, which is the heaviest end, off of the ground. We've got it strapped as far to the heavy end as we could under the circumstances because we're wedged in here really tight. And then we got that second strap there. The hope is that maybe I could curl that bucket up and get this big heavy end off the ground just a little. So let's see how it goes. Today my wife, who's just a tiny bit camera shy, is going to get the final sanding and the first layer of uh, polyurethane on there. So by the end of the day it should look very pretty. Give you a look here after the end of the day, see how it looks. All right, this is the goal right here. This was a test piece. Uh, look how pretty that thing is. The idea is for that to look like this, but about a thousand times bigger. And my construction guy, Ryan, he's already whining about these being sequoia trees and too big to move around, but we'll figure it out. We'll get them in the house. But look at that, how beautiful that is. Should be two in the living room and one downstairs by the bar, if all goes well. All right, here we are after my wife put on the first coat. Look at how beautiful that thing is. 
wow I'm thinking back of how much work this was and how much of a pain but man these are gonna be beautiful basically free for the cost of some serious back labor and tractor labor good job babe looking forward to it check out the red down here can't see it quite as much now as when I cut it but beautiful 